Today we will start our 12th lecture of the course Digital Electronics. In today's lecture we will study the latch. We have SR latch and we are using the NOR gate in it. Okay. So first we will draw the symbol of the NOR gate. This is the symbol of the NOR gate. Okay. And uh, its truth table is if we have input 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0. To explain the truth table of the NOR, the simple we can say whenever we have 1 in the input, the output will be 0. We have to remember this rule. On the fingertip to solve our SR latch in speed. So now we will draw the SR latch, the NOR gate, and the other NOR gate. One is for the S and one is for the R. SR means set reset latch. So this one and this one. Their outputs are Q and Q bar. This is S. This is R. S output is Q bar. And the R output is Q. The one input is S. And the other output is the output of the R. Other input. This is input S and Q. And for the R we have the other input with R. Which is Q bar the output of the S one. Now we will make its truth table S R Q and Q bar. We have one and zero. So when we have one, this is one, S is one, and the R one is zero. Okay. So we can see um, when we have one input whenever we have one input the output will be zero so for this we can say the output of the s1 is zero q bar is zero it will be the input of the r with r sorry the r has its own value zero q bar is zero zero and zero will give us one so it means q is one Now we will solve the second one. If the S is 0 and the R is 0. If S is 0 and R is 0. We can see that now we have. We should know the other one input. So we can solve the NOR gate further. So now we will imagine that. Q is 1. Okay, we are imagining, we are taking it by ourselves that the Q is 1. So, whenever any of the input is 1, the output is 0. Q bar will be 0. Now, we will recheck this one. 0 and 0, the, uh, the output will be 1, that is Q. Now, we will solve it again with 0 and 0. Now, we will imagine that if in case the Q is 0. So if the Q is 0, the output will be 1, Q bar will be 1 and when 1 will go here, there is the 1, there is 0, the output will be 0 which is the value of Q. The next thing is if S is 0 and R is 1. If S is 0 and R is 1, so whenever any of the input is 1, the output will be 0, Q is 0. Q is 0 and S is 0, the output will be 1, Q bar will be 1. Now, if, now we have to see that if S is 1 and R is 1, then both the outputs will be 0. That the SR latch for the 1, 1 is invalid. This is an invalid state and for the 0, 0, we will get the states, we call them whole state uh, for the 0 and 0, yes. These are the whole states. 
now to solve this invalidity we will study we will study the sr flip flop this one was the sr latch in which we get the invalid value and in sr flip flop we will solve this invalidity 